Hello witches and wizards and welcome back to my channel. This is Goofy G and you're watching Hogwarts Legacy. Alright guys, we learned how to fly. Which is insane. Which means we'll be able to get to places quicker. Instead of running and walking. Now, when we last left off, we got a bunch of quests thrown at us. And uh, so now these are level requirements 6 and 8. And we are obviously at 16, which is pretty good. Um, but we do need... Uh, these other things so i thought let's do another story mission and get the room of requirement going on although i could do this small quest but i thought let's just do this one right now let's get room of requirement because it is a big part of this game and we do need to get into potions and stuff like that and whoops i threw my cabbage away is it attack me too no <laughs> okay then wasted that anywho uh, we need to go. Yes, we need to go. We need to get to uh, Professor Weasley and we will use our fast travel Astronomy wing Which is the closest Seems like uh, The one on top shall also do the trick Where in between we can go up and down both so we required we acquired I mean uh, 12 talent points from which I think I spent only one because I was like let's see if uh, how I would need right now I, so I did a little research obviously because the uh, skills are whatever talent you pick is that's it there's no respecking in it or uh, resetting it or getting all maximized so we had to pick and uh, fortunately I picked few s decent ones uh, the, the one I want to use actually so Anyways, more of that later. Let's begin the quest. Let's get let's get ourselves a room of requirement. It's about time. Professor Weasley. We are in year five, though. Mm. That's so when we do get access to room requirements. Oh, look at that! It's just gonna pop open, right? <laughs> oh yeah. Let's do this. Let's do this. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. Oh. I see you've wasted no time. Yes, we have not. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. Yeah, I'm not walking into the door first. <laughs> I just open, randomly appeared on a wall. <laughs> first you. Oh, it's is the this way place? they left it in the This is the room movies. of requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. Floating I don't candles, guys. Revelio. Just to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now, where is Deke? Hmm, he must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor. The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. Okay. She wants to take advantage of us as soon as she found room of requirement and she wants to find Deke. Rebellion. I mean, I don't know who was writing this, but... There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, Ooh. the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. Oh, wow. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Sure, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, wow. Look at this movement. Oh, this is going to be tricky. All right, let's go. Evanesco. Poof! It has that symbol of poof. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Sure thing. Uh, all right. 
Uh, we need the uh, Venesco, please. On the square. Yeah, let's do that. Excellent oh, sweet! Work. You'll note that you are now in possession of moon. Oh yes, we got eight moonstone. We moon shall stone. discuss its uses later. Let's oh, move on. Can we just gather that from doing? <laughs> just keep flicking. Where this. in Merlin's Rebellion. name is that elf? Oh, look at all of these things around. So much. Is that goodness, my old school bag. I wondered where that had gone. I waited to. for you here, but I was assigned to find one. Can't enemies. believe it's still here. T from A to T. Quick look at this. Sure. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. All right. Uh, we found this map from A to T now. Rebellion. I can't think of anyone right now at the moment from A to T. Who could it be? <gasps> can't you keep it down? Was Some it? Of us are trying to rest. <gasps> Was it? Okay, okay. I don't remember the name of the the lady, but from the movies and Ravenclaw, common with the ghost. What was the name? Was it with A? Because from T means Tom Riddle, because he's the one who stole the diadem, right? Ruvina Ravenclaw. So it's not A. It doesn't have to be A. Unless it's someone else. I mean, it's a good uh, shot right in the dark. <laughs> or who else could it be? I don't know. I don't know. Hello there. Oh, she did she be right? Lumos. Is she happy now? Let me <laughs> okay. Get some more moonstones, sweet. Rebellion. Guys, floating candles. Is this the treasure chest that we've been we spent like twenty minutes in the previous part? I believe so. Still need to get used to these uh, spell changing things. Honestly, it's uh, this guy just keeps drinking tea and stuff whenever he gets the opportunity to do that. Yikes. Okay. Or oh, do we have to push it to like uh, climb over it? Oh wow. <laughs> okay then, Mr. Ezio. I did not know that you could do these things. Rebellion. All right, now I know the chest had floating candles and stuff like that. Oh wait, 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 wait. Can we accio that thing? Accio. Oh yes. Oh yes. Revelio. So that means. Uh, okay, that's on the other side itself. Correct, 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 correct. I hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. Yeah, this looks wrong. There's like smoke and stuff coming out. No, not that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin. <laughs> Look at all, all kinds of stuff is there. Bit offended the room though I needed a bath. Cheeky thing. <laughs> okay. Rebellion. Someone stinky was passing by, I assume. Grindstone. People have been doing some crazy things over here. Uh alright, uh, this one, this one. Akio. Rebellion. Okay. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? <laughs> Through that, how Rebellion. does how do they? How do do they they? Uh, 
Hello? That would be cool if they have used revenue and like it showed like a ghost is playing. That would have been fun. Rebellion. What was that? Was that a golden stitch? Where? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> okay then. Look at how this proper maze that they've made over here. Revelio. Nope. Should open from the other side. I'm assuming if that's the right way to do it. Oh. You're kidding me. Oh, did I mess this up? Akio. I messed it up right. Huh. I'm spamming square. Oh, is it going to tilt over? What? Oh no! Our gear slots are full. Oh, that's not good at all. Oh, that's not good at all. I should have checked my inventory. Oh damn it! Okay, okay. We need to we need to clear out space, guys. That's not good for us. We could be finding some good stuff. Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's see now. Ninety. Oh, we need to sell. We need to sell green stuff because they are the least um, valuable at the moment. So we can destroy this. We still have to. Yeah, we need room of requirement to find these qualities. Okay, we deleted two things. None of these are stronger than what we have. Could delete another one of this. Okay. Let's see if we can grab that right now. So this is the way you do it, guys. In case. It's a slow process, but it does the trick. Got it. Mahogany fingerless gloves and these are of better stats. So we will equip them right away Although I, I would have liked it if it was of a better quality, <laughs> but it's fine. I guess we get to sell everything now I hope that house elf can find us in there I hope so too Revelio. Oh, we can't run so this is a uh, a little scripted. Oh, perfect. We have a fast travel that's unlocked over here. Oh, there the house, house elf is. Hello, Mr. House Elf. Yikes! Careful! Huh? <laughs> oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. Alright, Deke. Uh, 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 how conveniently uh, she just popped Hello. Up. Deke, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. 
Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. Oh, wow. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deke's seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> wow. Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus okay. on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. We need a gamer room, guys. The room will do the rest. RGB lights. Some solid... PC, good consoles, nice screens, everything. Yikes. Check this out. Self-arranging clearing room. Wow. Given yourself quite a canvas to work with. Yep. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. Excellent. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. Sure, you have unlocked the. You reveal the magic properties of any unanifan gear you have collected. Alright. Uh, let's identify. Oh, we don't need to select manually. Cool. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable Rebellion. resource. It shall. It seems like it's already done its job. Talk to her. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. Yes, please. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. I can see that. Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Oh, wow. Nice, conjuring spell. Let's go! It's all X. Oh no, it's not all X. X. Square. Triangle. X. Got him. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Right. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. Sure. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. Correct. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Ooh. Hmm. Quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. Yeah, that is you pretty should cool. find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plots and brew potions in class. That is sick though, that you can refund your resources after conjuring something. So that is nice. Um, where is this conjuring spell? Alright. Um, oh, 
Okay, conjure a potting table, conjure a potion station. Okay. We have two, we have four corners. Uh, so let's start with, um, wait, if we need, these are books. So let's do potions right opposite. <laughs> Oh, look at this. Potions. Item used to brew potions. Uh, item herbology, potions, utility, wall decoration, artwork, decorations, furniture, rugs, seating, tables, statues, seasonal decorations. What? We can do all of this? That's crazy. Alright, let's start with potions. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Small scientific potion stations. This is a, we have we have 117 moonstone. Crazy. Potion station budget zero of one conjured. Okay. Small scientific potion. Small botanical potion station. Small electric potion station. Small gothic potion station. Oh my god. T shaped gothic potions. Medium. Medium, medium. And then T-shaped. So isn't T-shaped better than? Okay, for now let's just do with the small. No, let's just do the first one, right? For one burner for brewing potions. Oh, we can change like that. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, let's let's pick what we find more cool. Yeah, let's go with the blue theme since we are uh, okay. Uh, aha, see, we can rotate them. Nice. I don't know. For now, let's uh, keep it over here, shall we? And change color. Oh wow, we can do this. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, we're gonna keep everything to uh, blue for now. Let's conjure it. Oh, now we need a potting table. Okay, 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 okay. How do I? Um, hopping pots. Scientific, Botanical, Electric, Gothic. I need to know the difference of all these four ones. Uh, now we need a potting. Oh, we can't. We don't have a potting table thing. Oh, damn it. Oh, we need to buy all of this from Tomos and Score. Oh, great. Oh, everything is locked. Oh, no, no. Here we go. What is this? Scientific potting table with a small pot. Yeah, let's just stick to scientific. And we will uh, do a potting station over here. Correct. Well done. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Deke will be okay. here to answer any questions you may have. <laughs> Do not underestimate his insights. Sure thing. I'd like to more about Deke. Can you tell me a bit more? Well, he's been at Hogwarts longer than I have and seems to know we yeah, discovered that's good. this room together. Then you we know Deke this. Deke has had a good deal of experience. Okay. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready. But again, you would be what Sure. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. Okay. We've charms in place to enforce that. Very good. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. Correct. But the room of requirement has its own rules. Thank you. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. 
Um, all right, let's see what else can we use. Revelio. Okay, okay. Let's 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 uh, <laughs> let's do this. Let's summon a new rug. Seating. Tables are both empty and decorated. But what is this? Oh, just decorative. Okay, okay, okay. What about these? Oh man, we can spend all day in this. I've more to teach you about transfiguration. If you have a moment. And you know what? I'll, I'll put this one. Check out all of this, man. This is crazy. This is crazy. I will put this there. Does that benefit us anyway? I don't think so. Um, so let's not just go ahead with crazy with that. Smart reflection. Various totems. Why not? Oh, these guys require a big space. Oh, we can change size as well. Oh. Sick. Oh, oh, oh. oh man, we can do this all day. Wow. Okay. What is this? Desk of description. Oh no, we already have that. Uh, what else that do we have? Okay, let's get a nice mirror. Let's get a nice mirror. Let's get a giant mirror. Oh, bigger. Bigger. <laughs> uh, this is fine. Uh, it's not in the center. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so let's 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 uh, try to do that, right? Oh, it's as easy as that. Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. That is cool. Uh, big place. This looks like the center, right? Yep. Okay. That's cool. And then what else do we have? Let's get another wall uh, painting. Let's get another one of these fancy stuff. Oh no, so these are all the paintings that popped up. So it's the same type, you get the option down below. Okay, pretty cool. What is this? Like a big bowling ball? Let's, let's put something weird. Oh. Well, that's the lady who waved at us, so I think I think she deserves a wall. Let's do that. And then 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 rugs. Sure, why not? No, you know, rugs is fine. We don't need rugs. Furniture. We can use furniture. We can use a chair. Scientific chair. Botanical chair. Is it their way of just saying things? Ah, oh, damn it. Yeah, two chairs by the side by each other is uh, is cool. And what is this? Statues. Oh. I've more to teach you about transfiguration. If you have a moment. Statue. Okay, fine. You know what? We'll just put one in here. Yeah, that's a nice place. <laughs> uh, that's nice. Oh, we can definitely do this all day, man. That is so cool. Our floor looks fine. I'm, I'm so not done with this. <laughs> oh, this is so good. And it's so easy as well. It's so easy. Damn. 
Let's put a table. Why not? Let's just put a nice table for her setting. Beasts. Yeah. Why not? Whoa. Oh man, look at how. This is too good. Yeah, we have to keep it like that. Like a big man. You know, this looks pretty cool. And uh, we can change its color also. Let's go with this this one. This looks crazy. Yeah, we'll change the color for this. No, I think I think we'll go with black. Yep. The beastie boy. <laughs> I need to put a rug, sorry. <laughs> oh, this is too fun, man. This is good fun. I like it. I don't think rugs are looking good. And maybe you can put them underneath these. Just so my flooring is not spoiled, right? Change color. Nice. <laughs> I'm totally gonna use refund all of them. Most likely. Interact. Didn't he? Sure. And that's how it's that's how easy it is. Okay, let's be planted Didn't he? and let's uh, get this editor's portion going. Why not? We have two of these going as well. That's pretty cool. Let's talk to her. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the return to me once you've gathered enough. All right, let's take out the thing behind her. And let's take out this chair. One chair in that spot is fine, I guess. Okay, we can't move these, seems like. Uh, what else can we move around? What about this? No, we need this uh, table for sure. Oh, that mirror. We can move that mirror. A mirror looks cool over here though. Oh, these are the paintings around. Oh, okay, okay. I just moved those paintings around. That's why I was like, I didn't unlock those. All right, let's talk to her again. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. You can conjure more than potion. Conjuration can be used to decorate. Why don't you try it on the... Well, I already have, so... Oh, no, no. Professor. Yes? There are so many choices. Okay, we have uh, dialogue options, but it's basically we know how to do. I'm all set. I think I can manage. Conjure, conjure floor decorations. Okay, we need to do conjure floor decorations. So, these are the floor decorations. Let's get... Uh, what's in this? Yeah, let's get one of these. I seem to enjoy them. <laughs> oh wow. Oh wow. This is oh this is sweet. Come on. Come on. Yep. Good work. Shall we move on? Yes, yes, yes. Protego. <laughs> I've conjured everything I can. I think you're ready to. The altering spell will allow you to custom. You All can right. change the colors, patterns. I mean, we've done that. Oh, it's a new spell altogether. Wow. It's 
a new spell altogether altering. That's pretty cool. But we know how to change the colors and stuff. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize it. Sure. So let's customize uh, this. Great. Oh! Oh wow, look at what is available. <laughs> We went, we went. After all the style of an item, let's just do this. Style, let's change the style. A size, make it smaller, sure. And color. Let's do white. Nicely done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. Whoa, what else? I you think can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Try aiming at the floor. All to the balcony or the floor of the room. Let's let's do the balcony. Oh, oh my god. Let's go with this like full on work. Yeah. <laughs> All to the balcony or the floor or the room. I mean, we did the. We'll go with this. Actually, let's go with this. Your space might benefit it looks much better. Ambiance, don't you think? Deke, would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. All right, let's see. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Eh. A cool moonlit ambience sounds perfect. I like something natural and earthy. Focus best room that's dark and mysterious. I mean, that's the ideal setting, right, for any one of us. <laughs> Whoever is uh, uh, recording his stuff. But uh, a cool moonlit ambience sounds perfect to me. But um, yeah, let's let's go with this. A cool moonlit. I like. Th I think that's pretty cool. I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Hmm. Sounds perfect. Maybe we can alter it again by speaking to him. And oh wow. Oh yeah, this is our look. Oh yeah, definitely. This also kind of reminds me the Archmage's quarters from Skyrim. Hmm quite a difference of course of course you needn't keep this style if you don't like it you can always Perfect. ask deke to change now you have learned a good thank you professor indeed no matter how much time all right this is sick itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spellcrafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. All right, guys, this is awesome. And we spent a quite a bit over here and I think we will continue to do so. Also, we got another talent point. I'll get back to you guys in the next one. Until then, keep watching and see you soon. Bye-bye.